Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another MAMG Let's Play of WikiHow the Quiz, or what? Why the quiz game is pretty much what this is. But I had a ton of fun with this last time, and I wanted to make sure I spaced it out a little bit so I wasn't doing this non-stop, but it seems like a lot of you guys enjoyed it too. So we're gonna see if we can guess some more of these crazy WikiHow articles. Uh, when I loaded the page, this is what it came to. So this is the first one, apparently. It's a lady thinking about how she wants to be punched in the face, I believe. Okay, how to run away from home. <laughs> yeah, I did it. Refuse a kiss, act like one of the guys, or impress a classmate. Um, well, you could punch somebody, and that would definitely refuse a kiss. I don't know how that's gonna help you run away from a home, although she is wearing a backpack. So, we could assume school-related or runaway-related at that point? I don't know. I still think it'd be act like one of the guys. Like, yeah, we did it! Or, you could just be punching somebody. That's the two things that fists are pretty much for, right? That sounded like a weird question. Um, how to act like one of the guys. Sure. Boom. How to run away from home. Neat. Oh my god, what is this? Why is that a, a rainbow line? And why is that pole so close to your crotch? How to induce nightmares. <laughs> yeah? How to buy used electronics, pole vault, or support the arts. I mean, I guess I'm gonna go with the, the regular thought process here of how to pole vault, although if that is not going to be a successful pole vault, I'm pretty sure you're gonna induce some nightmares. Alrighty, we did it. Why is it rainbow? How to... Resist sexual desires by following exomic traditions. Don't think a bottle of wine is part of the exomic tradition. Get anime eyes, be a good wife, or be an educated man. Um... Is it just me or is that dude not making eye contact with this girl? I don't think he is. I don't think he's making eye contact at all. And she's just got the derpiest look on her face. So it's probably either a good wife or an educated man. I'm gonna say it's how to be an educated man and it's gonna tell you not to stare at the woman's cleavage. Ah, is it really? Does it tell you not to? Or is it just an unfortunate, unfortunate thing? Let's see, where is it? Where's the picture? I don't see it. Is it down here? No, did I go too far? Is my internet being slow? Where... where is it? It's gone. I don't... It lied to me. Go to museums... It, it definitely lied to me. The only picture that's here is this one. I, I feel deceived. Okay, whatever. We're gonna keep moving on. I'm gonna say, be a good educated man and make eye contact with the lady if you're having dinner with her. Come on, guys. See, this is what happens when you don't. What? Uh oh, there's a handcuff on me. Deal with a love triangle, become a teen hacker, how to know your warning signs beca before becoming abusive, or how to know when you'll get your first period. Yep, when the handcuff comes on, then the alarms go off, you're about to become a full woman. Full grown woman. Full woman? I, I, don't, I don't know, I'm sorry. Words are coming out and I'm not even sure what I'm talking about. Not a love triangle, maybe a teen hacker. Yes. Although, I don't know how you want to become one if it's telling you you're going to be arrested. I, I don't, I don't. Mm. <laughs> this is an educated man, right? How to make your boyfriend kiss you, how to get your nipples pierced, how to be laid back or survive a freestyle rap battle. Well, if this is a rap battle, I think everybody loses. I'm pretty sure you're not going to get your boyfriend to kiss you, and she doesn't look like she wants a kiss right now. Nipples being pierced, I, I don't see that happening unless like it was just so painful that it numbed his tongue for whatever reason and he's just like, what, what did you do? Why did you pierce my nipple and now my tongue doesn't work? Be laid back. I, I mean, like at this point you might as well be annoyed, but sure, be laid back? I, I don't know how we get these right. I really don't. How to love yourself so much. What are you trying to do with your life? Understand heterosexual people. This this is it. If you want to know what it feels like to be heterosexual, just gotta push those cheeks up. Straight up into your eyeballs. How to act like the doctor of Doctor Who. Stop binge drinking or understand gay and lesbian people. Well, at least now we have pretty much the main categories. You have heterosexual people, gay, and lesbian people, although there's a bunch of subcategories that we're not even gonna fall into, but I'm pretty sure that's not what it has to do with. Maybe stop binge drinking. Maybe you're just so sad that there's no alcohol in your life that the only thing you can do is force yourself to smile. I'm gonna go with that. How is this? No. How? 
Okay, first off, seeing gay and lesbian people as people. Really? You need an article to know how to see people as people. Ugh. Seriously, come on. Oh, uh, what, what, what? Human rights campaign? Okay. Um. Where, where is this forced smile? That looks forced too. Okay, what is this? Fake it till you make it. The process doesn't happen overnight, and even the best intentions, you may still find yourself uncomfortable or confused with gay people. This will change with time as you continue to work at it. In the meantime, however, the most important thing is to treat gay and lesbian people with respect and dignity. If you do this regularly, you'll probably begin to understand gay and lesbian people and... I don't know. I don't know about that advice. Fake it till you make it makes it sound like you're, you're just doing it because and... I mean, obviously, I just read this one paragraph, but like, you need to come to terms with the fact that you're being discriminatory towards people. Not fake it till you make it. I, I don't like that one. But whatever. That's where that comes from, apparently. I'm not here to get all political. How to live in an anime. Keep dogs off the lawn. Trick people into thinking you're possessed. How to know when you get your first period and make lemonade when life gives you lemons. C can it please be how you know when you get your first period? Please? No, nope, it's make lemonade. I figured it was with the yellow shapes, but maybe it's just a glorious, wonderful experience. It's, I, I've heard stories and it's not. How to creep out anyone with one single picture. Be the type of nerd that girls love, plan a Disney vacation, impress a classmate, or develop common sense. I don't think any of these fit. Impress a classmate? You, you like me? Yeah, with that side glance that's really awkward. The type of nerd that girls love. Steps, be sweet. Be confident, okay? Branch out, be nice. You guys, you guys got this? You taking notes? This is what nice looks like. Right here. This is exactly what nice looks like. Um, okay. Not just girls. <laughs> be nice to everybody. Help people when they ask you. What? That doesn't have to do about... What's that have to do about being a nerd? I don't get it. It's weird. Look at this guy. He's doing the Numa Numa dance. Good for you, bringing that back for everybody. Oh God, your teeth are sticking out of your mouth. That that's not good. Stop thinking that accepting help is a sign of weakness. How to cosplay Barbie? Catch a cheating girlfriend or have fun without friends? Well, clearly she's got some friends. I don't know if this this lady's cheating unless she's just like Duh! with a bunch of other guys. <laughs> but maybe, um, maybe it's accepting help. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Co cosplay Barbie? What? Barbie's got teeth on the outside of her mouth? Is that what you're gonna tell me? I don't. Remember your values. The most important thing is be yourself. Feel good and happy and try not to be something that you're not. I, I give up. I give up. This this article is about how to cosplay as Barbie, but at the end of it, it's like, but, but don't. Don't do that. Why would you want to do that? You just gave me 12 steps to tell me what I'm supposed to be doing. And then step number 13 is, but don't? What is this? What is this? Do I need to like become a wiki how author? Oh, never mind. What are you doing? Um, how to know if you have or did have dis dissociative personality disorder? Become a world citizen, a dance emo, or a punk? What does that have to do with somebody doing yoga? What is? I, I just want to know what dance emo means. Please be this one, a world citizen. So what, just respect values and stuff? Or are you gonna tell me not to? Where, where is it? Konnichiwa, of course. Um, I, I don't see it yet. Money? Money has to be involved. Got it. Where is this picture? It's not here. You lied to me. That's the second time I've been lied to. I don't see a dude doing yoga at all. Hmm. I feel I feel kind of bummed. I feel disappointed. I feel lied to. But whatever. I, I can't. I can't. What are you? How to tell if you genuinely like someone. Be cunning. Simplify your life. Or send dirty texts. This man looks like he's being electrocuted by the young lady. 
And, I mean, it's not like he doesn't like it, it's just kind of weird. How to tell if you genuinely like somebody? Well, maybe you're just getting all the, all the goosey bumps, right? Oh, that's so sweet, I guess. What is this? Why? Wh what? What? How to date a stripper? Okay. How to say some common phrases in Esperanto? How to tell a girl you like her? Well, apparently you kill someone, give her money, and then buy her a drink. Win a race. Is it how to date a stripper? Okay, cool. Now, I'm just saying this for research purposes, for curiosity purposes. What kind of steps do they tell you? Steps. Offer the benefit of the doubt. Okay. Know what you're getting into. Find a club where you feel comfortable. Show up early. Start a conversation. Tip her on stage, but don't get a laugh dance from anyone. Leave it when it, leave the club when it gets too busy and all the girls start giving lap dances. Ask her out. That would be a key part of, you know, dating a, a, anybody. Be accepting of her job. Why? I mean, sure. What is this? How is this an okay image for like anybody to submit? How to grow your hair super long? False. Choose a rigorous college schedule for your first year. How to make yourself pee or enjoy pornography in the comfort of your own home. What? Why? Why is this a thing? One of the people's faces look like they're upside down. I don't get this. Um, how to make yourself pee. Sure. Choose a rigorous college schedule for your first year. Are all the pictures like this? They are. Wow. Okay. I mean, I'm not dissing anybody if that's, if that's their style. Um, sure, but at the same time, it, it looks like yeah, you were, you know, studying pretty rigorously when you made this article as well. Okay, cool. Neat. Fun. Let's keep going. <laughs> that face, though. Uh, okay, grow your hair, be fascist, be a world citizen, or how to love yourself. I don't think this was in the world citizen thing, but I would assume you're not supposed to go to any beaches, you know, that are banned anywhere else. How to love yourself? By not going to the beach? How to love yourself? Grow your hair super long. Of course, because it's completely related to what you do at the beach. What is that picture even? Okay. How to know if you have or did have a dissociative personality disorder? Succeed in the relationship with the perfect girl. Just hover over her with your hands and an evil, evil grin. Uh, get a lesbian girlfriend. Just, just grab her. You just, when she's running away, you just snatch her away. Um, understand gay and lesbian people. I'm guessing this is a disorder thing. No. How to succeed in a relationship with a perfect girl. How is this a thing? Why are all these relationship related? Don't be obsessive. Give her some room. She looks like she needs help. Not a room. Uh, she doesn't need to be hanging on, uh, she doesn't need you to be hanging on her. She wants to be able to lean on you, not the other way around. Okay, sure. I mean, you guys tell me if this is good advice, because it sounds like terrible advice. Trump! Oh, God. How to be subtle about getting a guy to call you. You just, you just shout Trump. Um, respond to fundamentalists, okay. Play bridge or be a punk. Yeah, how to be a punk. Oh, okay. It's how you play bridge. That lady looks like she's having a terrible time. Actually, they both do. How to help paranoid people. How to make your girlfriend want to have sex with you. She's just holding on to the cushion like, no, not again. Uh, cheat on a test or dance at a nightclub. I'm guessing it's somebody who's paranoid. Okay. Wow. You have some choices to make, don't you? Laugh naturally on cue. Get along with your crush. Use French in conversations about mammals or how to win a tickle war. These are some crucial questions that we need to be asking. How to use French? Oh my god, I was right. I was like, are those flashcards? <laughs> Goodbye. Bye, lady. How to get a boy to dance with you and then kiss you at the end. Middle school. Because it's different for everything. How to live in a dungeon. <laughs> Goodbye. I'll never see you again. How to be famous on the internet, or how to choose a puppy. What? <laughs> if you become famous on the internet, tell your friends goodbye, because it's the last time you'll ever see them. I don't think any of these are good. 
How to choose a puppy. Bye puppy! I'm not gonna see you ever either. How to live in the dungeon. This is a middle- okay, what, what kind of advice are you giving middle schoolers? Are you going to dance? Um, okay. Then look fabulous. Of course. Hi. We got the hi there. Once you get to the dance, look around until you spot your crush slash a boy you want to dance with. Uh, hang on, hang on though. I'm just curious. I guess it is how to get a boy to dance with you. I'm like, why does the girl have to do everything? When the slow song comes on, seek the boy out. Dance with me? No. No, please don't. Uh, on the next slow song, if the boy has a girlfriend, find another one to dance with. Just dance with all the boys. Make sure to dance with them on the last song of the night because it makes a good impression. I had a nice time. Okay, and then... But wait, wasn't it? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. If the boy has a girlfriend, find another one to dance with. So... But this is your crush, right? That you're asking, or are you just picking random people and asking them if they have boyfriends? And then if they don't, then you just dance with that person. I don't... Think you should be... Goodbye. Okay. Um. Middle school dance? Like, at the end of that night, you're just gonna try and kiss somebody? Okay, sure. Maybe I'm old school. Maybe I'm just a crudgety old man and what is wrong with your nose? Make someone, uh. How to make someone you met on MSN love you? How to be subtle about getting a guy to call you? How to help paranoid people or how to buy used electronics? None of these have to do with a gigantic nose disorder. Sure, MSN sounds good. You're probably lying about your profile. Hi ladies, are you okay? How to be an educated man, build a child's self-esteem, laughter yoga, or get a lesbian girlfriend. Well, the fact that only one of these has to do with two women in the frame, I'm guessing... Okay, cool. Oh my god, you look angry. How to deal with a sarcastic person, yell in their face. Be a good husband. Again, I don't think yelling at somebody's gonna help with that. Survive a charging elephant. That that has to be one. Oh my god, it is! <laughs> I didn't even read the other one. That is not an elephant. I'm sorry, but that man is not an elephant. Unless the elephant's charging at you. This is a picture of you, and you're about to charge at it. Oh god, okay, what is this one? How to act drunk, capture somebody, be a good husband, or believe in God. Act drunk by drinking out of a coffee mug. What is this? The joy of living. Oh, looks like you've already nailed it, buddy. Step one and you're good to go. <laughs> Alright, we'll do one more. I'm so glad I chose to do one more. Kick out a dangerous roommate, be persuasive, survive domestic violence, or pull an all-nighter. If you're going to this level to pull an all-nighter, Y you probably need to sleep. Oh my god, it is. Oh, I hit play again instead of the article. Okay, we'll do this one too. Prevent depression. Get over eavesdrop phone sex that you had without knowing it was eavesdrop. Be less clingy or be emotionless. Prevent depression by punching yourself in the face. Oh, we have to look at this one. Okay, don't beat yourself up because of this. It's very important to take, uh... It's a very important step to take because beating yourself up is not going to reverse the eavesdrop phone sex that you had. Uh, okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't let it define you or your life. Don't hate your sexual organs and desires because of the situation. Don't let the situation make you have low self-esteem. Don't seek revenge. <laughs> yeah. Don't let the situation depress you because you're dating or cause sexual anxiety and suicidal thoughts. This is just weird. Forgive the person who let others eavesdrop. Why, why are you naked? This is weird. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna leave this episode here. But uh, either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed and if we should do another one. Because I feel like it's giving terrible advice. But I did have a lot of fun. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next MAMJ. Let's play. Don't be sad. Well, I wonder what this article's about. How to sue for emotional distress. C could you not please sue me? Just, just don't, don't be sad, it's okay. Please don't sue me. How to enjoy phone sex, how to cosplay Barbie, and how to make someone feel better via text message. Yes, because if somebody I know is depressed, 
I'm just gonna shoot them a quick don't be sad message, ship it off, and then um, I'm good. I'm done. That's all I need to do. I did my deed for the day. Please tell me it's not this. It is. That's not how you should do it. It's really not.